So for this problem to find the derivative of a radical, so using this general power formula, then for this given, so first, we need to rewrite this given in an exponential form. So this is equal to y equals x to the power 4 minus 7x squared plus 5x minus 8. Then for the exponent, so this is 1 over 4. So the root is the denominator of the exponent. Then from this equation, so we have now u equals, so this inside the parentheses, so x to the power 4 minus 7x squared plus 5x minus 8. Then du, so the derivative of u, the derivative of x to the power 4, this is 4x minus 1 to the power 3. Then minus the derivative of 7x squared, so multiply 7 and 2, so 7 times 2, this is 14. Then x minus 1, so to the power 1, then plus the derivative of 5x, so this is 5, so the derivative of a constant and a variable, so just drop the variable. Then for the derivative of a constant, this one is 0, so du is equal to 4x to the power 3 minus 14x plus 5. Then apply now this formula, so we have now y prime equals n, so n is the exponent, so 1 over 4, then times u, and u is x to the power 4 minus 7x squared plus 5x minus 8, then we have n minus 1, so this 1 fourth minus 1, so we're going to use the shortcut method for this 1 fourth minus 1. So just subtract 1 minus 4. So 1 minus 4, this is negative 3. So therefore, we have negative 3 over. You copy the denominator. So this is negative 3 over 4. So if we have 2 over 5 minus 1, so subtract 2 minus 5, so 2 minus 5, that's negative 3, so this is negative 3 over, you copy the denominator, that's 5. Then if we have 6 over uh, 3, then minus 1, so you subtract 6 minus 3, so this is 3, then over, copy the denominator 3, or this is equal to 1. So therefore, this 1 fourth minus 1, so 1 minus 4, that's negative 3. Then you copy the denominator, then times du, or the derivative of u, so that's 4x to the power 3 minus 14x plus 5. Then to simplify, so since this one is negative, so you bring down, so therefore the denominator becomes 4, then times, so you bring down, that's x to the power 4 minus 7x squared plus 5x minus 8. And this negative denominator becomes positive, 3 over 4. Then for the numerator, so 4x to the power 3 minus 14x plus 5. So this is now the derivative for this function. Then for this given, so convert to exponential form. So this is x to the power 3 minus 2x squared minus x plus 6. Then for the exponent, so we have 5 over 3. So the root is the denominator. Then using now this formula, so we have u 
is this equation inside the parentheses. So x to the power 3, 2x squared minus x plus 6, then du. So the derivative of x to the power 3, this is 3x minus 1 to the power 2, then minus the derivative of 2x squared. So multiply 2 times 2, this is 4x minus 1 to the power 1, then minus for the constant in a variable. So you drop the variable, therefore, this is 1. And for the derivative of a constant, this one is 0. So du is 3x squared minus 4x minus 1. Then apply now this formula to find the derivative. So we have n. n is the exponent. So this is 5 over 3 then times u. So u is x to the power 3 minus 2x squared minus x plus 6. Then for n minus 1, so using the shortcut method, so 5 minus 3, that's 2. Then you copy the denominator, so we have 3. Then times du, and du is 3x squared minus 4x minus 1. Then to simplify, so multiply this 5 to this 3x squared. So this is 15x to the power 2. Then 5 times negative 4. So we have negative 20x and 5 times negative 1, that's negative 5, then times. So since this one is positive, so stay in the numerator. So this is x to the power 3 minus 2x squared minus x plus 6 to the power 2 over 3, then all over 3. So this is now the derivative for this function.